Korea's stock market is losing momentum, with the benchmark Kospi fluctuating in the smallest margin ever in the first six months of this year. Analysts say this is mainly due to slowing economic growth at home. Hwang Jie tells us more. It's as if the Korean stock market has had its pause button pushed. The Korea Exchange says the nation's benchmark Kospi is losing its vitality, with market volatility in the first half of the year hitting a mere 0.6, its lowest point since 1990 when the market first opened. The closer the index is to zero, the more stagnant the market. The figure was at over two in the second half of 2011, but has continued on a downward trend ever since. And it's not just the dynamism, but also the number of transactions that remains subdued. The average daily transactions volume on the nation's main bourse came in at around 23 million in the first half of this year, marking the lowest level in seven and a half years. Analysts attribute the lackluster performance over the past three years to sluggish domestic demand and the slowing Chinese economy. Korea is heavily dependent on exports to China. The nation's industries are also closely linked to those in China, so the slumping economy there had a major impact on the economy here. Analysts add that the recent strength in the local currency trend has eroded the profitability of local companies and is keeping the stock market from perking up, but they also forecast better conditions in the second half. They say the global economy, more importantly the U.S. economy, is on a rebound trend, which will result in more robust exports for Korea, eventually raise local corporate profitability and put some pep in the stock market's step. Hwang Jie, Arirang News.